a heck of a day of parades and parties, and it continues in downtown Mobile. Crew Day Local 15 and our team of reporters continues to bring you all the action. And from the Comet Cowboys to the Mamga Mammoth Parade and the people in Bienville Square, we have you covered if you missed any of the action today. This Fat Tuesday has been chock full of beads and moon pies. Unfortunately, it has also been full of cold and rain along the Gulf Coast. Local 15's Christian Jennings has more from downtown. It's been one of the coldest Fat Tuesdays on record for Mobile, but it didn't stop revelers from packing downtown streets to snatch up beads, moon pies, and ramen noodles. Shoo! She almost got hit in the head with the whole box. Tell me about that. Well, I know my husband will uh, eat them for about two days now because I don't have to cook. No, but it, it was really nice. It was fun. I just like to catch stuff. But are the throws worth it if it means standing in the rain to get them? Apparently, the answer is yes. It's only once a year. If it's once a year, you have time to do it. Tell me about your struggle with this weather. Well, it wasn't a struggle for me. I actually work in fashion, so I just packed about three suitcases. Five dress shirts, five ties, two tuxedos, three suits, two pairs of boots, two sneakers, four more pairs of shoes, seven pairs of thermals, and some socks. And some families took it a step further by bringing tents and a grill to stay warm and dry. So we come down here and we cook and we grill and have fun. Christian Jennings reporting. Of course, it was a big, fat day full of parades all along the Gulf Coast today. The action cranked up in Mobile. The Order of Athena, 